Hi everybody, thank you so much for joining me for day three of Vlogmas. You might notice I have a new make on here that I whipped up last night. I'm going to put some footage in so you can see exactly what it is. This is the Sewing Revival Wingspan Top. Really easy pattern. The pattern piece is basically one piece flipped over. So you're cutting out one giant uh, pattern piece and then you're just doing either your facings or your bias binding. It is so easy to make. And the wonderful Janine from Sewing Revival has actually asked to give away one pattern a day into our advent calendar prizes. So you could be the lucky winner of this pattern if you choose. So don't forget, we're gonna draw the third window of the advent calendar at the end of this vlog. If you wanna be in the running, make sure you stick around till the end of the video. So join me now, I'm gonna take you with me to have a coffee at our favorite cafe, Brunetti's in the city. I'll let you know what I've bought from there as well as opening up some advent calendars. Now I need to show you my earrings. I'm going to be wearing, trying to wear a different pair of earrings every day. These are my little plum puddings that I bought from La Vissa, little uh, Christmas store uh, about two or three years ago now. So show you up close, really cute and glitzy. I think this matches this top beautifully. And I think this fabric was from a designer and many months ago I bought from Pit Trading, but nice and kind of boho. And I think it's really easy to wear this kind of style. I just love it. With a pair of jeans or a skirt, nice and floaty for summer. So do you want to open these calendars with me and let's see what we've got. Uh, I'm opening the chocolate one first, the Cocoa Black Christmas Advent Calendar. So I spoke about in the last couple of vlogs, I treated myself to one of these this year. So we are looking for day three, which I always have trouble finding okay down the bottom day three I'll open this up and see what I'll be having with my cup of tea <laughs> we actually have a coffee machine but it's getting serviced and we're still waiting for it to come back so I'm dying to have a proper cup of coffee cappuccino oh we have got a dark hazelnut cluster oh this looks nice with caramelized hazelnuts and it says 54% dark chocolate. 
look, it's, I always say if it's quality over quantity with chocolate. Uh, the labels, Colleen the Machine labels, I've showed you the little picture up close. Oh, this is a, oh, this is cute. This is a little patch. That is adorable. Look at that. It's a little sewing box. Little sewing kit with all the goodies in there. How cute is that? This is really getting fun now. Dying to see what the rest of the days have got in them. Last advent calendar is the Adore Beauty. Let me see. Day three. So st when they stare you in the face, all of these numbers, they just, I don't know, they're just hard to see sometimes, aren't they? Now, this one out. This is, this one's right down the bottom. Oh. This is a hard one. Okay. This is Makeup Forever Ultra HD, and I'd say that would be some kind of primer, I think. Let me have a look at that. See, how small is that writing? And if I don't wear my glasses, there is not a hope of me ever reading what it's meant to be. Primer. I'm not sure if it's an eye primer or a face primer but these are all little samples in the adore beauty box and so far i'm really liking uh, what they're putting in these little doors so really fun now you might have noticed on the video that we visited our favorite cafe in in melbourne in flinders lane it's called brunetti's it's a family-owned business have been around since the 50s they have a store in carlton as well as in flinders lane melbourne and i love their cakes so much which which is basically too much but any kind of event if you have to go in the city for anything we make sure we dive in and have a coffee and they do have the best coffee they also have a little campari bar with pizza down the back there as well but i decided to buy myself a panettone for christmas which is a beautiful christmas sweet bread cake uh, we always buy one of these every year but this is a special one because it's from Brunetti so I just love the packaging on that and uh, yeah it's one of our favorite things to have especially it's just lightly toasted with a bit of butter uh, it's really nice and a lot of people make trifles with the panettone as well uh, with the layers but look how cute that box is I actually want to keep that box I just think it's so gorgeous While I was in TK Maxx last week, I actually bought a limoncello or a lemon cream filled panettone as well. So they will literally keep for a long time. If they're not open, they'll keep fresh in their packaging. And it's just something really nice and different. If you love something sweet with a cup of coffee, you'd love panettone as well. So let's get on to opening the door for day three of Vlogmas. Because I know everyone's really excited to see who these winners are and if you haven't checked if you were one of the winners from yesterday or the day before make sure you double checking your comments if i've commented back to you and told you you're a winner you need to get in contact with me and via email which is on my vlog every time in the description box um yeah because we want to get these prizes out to you guys so day three is let me show you the actual little it's a little butterfly day three and this little wooden advent calendar is just so cute day three is Fabric Deluxe are giving away a wonderful prim sewing bundle. So there's all sorts of goodies in here. Now this package is from beautiful Steph and Carita in uh, Melbourne and Footscray. Fabric Deluxe is a fantastic store. They did give me a beautiful cut of linen to make a gorgeous Christmas dress with. But they've also got a brand new range. So many really decadent high-end fabrics in there lately. We've got a lot of brand name fabrics coming in I have noticed and some good old favourites like Lady McElroy. Uh, yeah, I just love their linens and they're great for, for bold plain colored fabrics and quality fabrics as well so i have got an episode where i did go and venture around their store back in winter time if you haven't seen that i'll link that above if you can go back and have a look at it but that will be being that will be getting sent out to the winner if you want to win this little bunch of goodies in here brand new prim sewing gadgets 
make sure you comment below and you'll be randomly drawn tomorrow morning and always remember if you can add a name or first name that is and what country you're from I'd love to hear where the viewers are from so that way the sponsors can see exactly where we are reaching to worldwide because it's just always nice to have either a little flag or a country's name there because I, I just find that fascinating because I'm getting to know a lot of the viewers uh, a lot of comments I love reading through your comments as well after each episode because it really keeps me motivated and uh, you always give me plenty of ideas as well and also there are more prizes not just the fabric deluxe bundle but there is the sewing revival pattern which i've mentioned earlier this um a pdf pattern from sewing revival the winner of the fabric deluxe prim bundle will also win two Starlark vouchers and that's fantastic because their patterns are one of my favorites i absolutely love their patterns they're brilliant such a huge catalog of patterns to choose from the winner of this will win all of these goodies so don't forget to comment to be in the running make sure you subscribe to the channel turn on that notification bell so you can be in the running to win one of these gifts for 12 days of vlogmas giveaways and also definitely think about uh, heading over to instagram and following me there because you can see things happening i will put out stories and put out winners that way if you want to keep on top of that you might want to find out a bit earlier if you have won that fantastic prize so hopefully it will be you thanks for watching i hope you've enjoyed day three i'll be back tomorrow to show you lots more of what i have in store this is only the start we are not even third of the way through we're up to day four tomorrow I hope you're enjoying Vlogmas. Please let me know if there's any hints, tips or ideas you'd like me to include and where you want to go for Vlogmas. Keep safe and keep sewing and let's get festive. We'll see you tomorrow for day four. Bye for now.